Will you please stand for a moment of silent meditation and remain standing as we honor our nation in reciting the Pledge of Allegiance. And now join me for the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Good morning, Fuller High School. I'm Demetrius Drake II. And I'm Joseph Drake. Welcome to another day of Fuller High School on a terrific Thursday. We have a lot of announcements for you today, so listen up, because this is the Lion Pride News. Good morning, Fall High School. My name is George Austin, and here are today's birthdays. Happy birthday to Evan Morris, Jalen Velez, Hope Chavez, Hannah Mayo, Armando Villalobos, and our Folly High teacher, Miss LeVette. Have a great day and a happy birthday. Hey, I'm here to give blood. Do you have your consent form? No. You have to go return it to Miss Luker in room 301. Okay, I'll go do that and I'll be right back. Okay, I turned it in. Do I get to donate blood now? Do you have your ID? I'll be right back. Okay, I have my ID. All right, did you drink plenty of fluids this morning? I sure did. All right, you're good to go. Thanks. The spring blood drive will be held on Wednesday, March 14th from 9 a.m. to 2 p.m. in the training room. All students who want to donate blood must have a signed consent form. You may pick up a consent form in room 301 or a hostess student will be delivering them in homeroom this week. After your consent forms are signed, you may bring it to 301 to make an appointment. Things to know is that you need to eat well and drink plenty of water for a few days before the blood drive. Eat a good breakfast and lunch the day of the drive. If you've turned in a signed consent form, you will receive an appointment card in homeroom on the day of the drive. Bring your appointment card with you with your photo ID to the blood drive. Students will not be allowed out of class without an appointment card. No student will be allowed to donate blood without a consent. Please feel free to email or see Ms. Luker in room 301 with any questions. The Foley Theater Company's spring production of The Addams Family is just around the corner. Friday and Saturday, March 23rd and 24th at 7 p.m. and Sunday, March 25th at 2 p.m. at the Foley Civic Center. Tickets may be purchased in advance or at the door. Tickets are $10 for adults and $8 for students. You're invited to the Junior Auxiliary of the Eastern Shore as they present the Project Prom on Saturday from 10 a.m. until 4 at Fairhope High School. One free dress will be allowed per person. You will need to have your student ID to enter to win prizes. The information is also on the school website. Please RSVP by text to Veronica at 251-234-4878 or Anne at 251-656. Five, it's time for the Pier Hopper's annual charity color run. The two mile Rainbow Dash will be lots of fun and will raise money for the Lupus Foundation. The Rainbow Dash will take place during 4th block on March 22nd, but you must sign up by March 14th. Registration forms can be found in Miss Champion's room 406 and Miss Cody's room 909. You can talk to any Pier Hopper in Miss Champion's room during Skinny for more details. Also, if someone wants to cheer on a friend, you can buy a spectator ticket for $3, but spots are limited to two spectators per runner. To participate in the Rainbow Dash, turn in registration forms by March 14th. Cheerleading and mascot tryouts for the 2018-2019 basketball and football season will be held March 19th through the 23rd. If you are interested in trying out and did not get to attend the parent meeting, please see Coach Gardner in room 217T for important trial information. <laughs> the ACT will be administered statewide on March 20th to all high school juniors. The Alabama State Department of Education will use student scores on this test for state school report cards. Between now and March 20th, 
we will be sharing some test information and strategies. For the math test, the benchmark needed is 22. Math specific strategies are, think about the question before looking at the answers. Make sure you answer the question. If it asks for radius, don't give diameter. Look for the information in the options. The answer choices sometimes provide valuable information about the form of the answer. If you get stuck on questions, try going through the answers and plugging them in. The correct answer is the one that works. Dummy it down. Plug in convenient numbers for variables to make a problem more concrete. Geometry questions. Draw a picture. Figures are not necessarily accurate to scale. Use your calculator wisely. Each question can be solved without a calculator. You need to be familiar with the calculator you bring. Good morning, seniors. Friday, April 6th, during Scanning Block, seniors will face off with different faculty members here at Foley in Seniors vs. Faculty Jeopardy match-off. Any seniors that are interested in competing against the teaching staff need to see Mrs. Cody. The money raised for this event will go toward the senior gift. Come on, class of 2018. Let's show FHS faculty what you're made of. Hey, Ms. Baxter, hey. I heard about the job shadowing online Friday. Can you give me more information about that? Yeah, so on March the 20th, the day that the juniors are taking the ACT, all seniors have the opportunity to do a job shadow or a community service project. Mr. Reed and I have posted all the opportunities that we've sought out on a sign up genius, and all you need to do is three things. You sign up on the Sign Up Genius. The link is located on the Senior Classroom page. Um, and also, you have to fill out three forms that are also located on the Senior Classroom page, which um, is liability forms and field trip forms. Okay, thank you. You're welcome. Good morning, Full High School. This is Leo Wise with your Locker Room Report. The softball teams will have a home game with the varsity starting at 5, followed by the JV at 6.30. The boys soccer teams will travel to the Christ the King School in Daphne to take on St. Michael's Catholic School. The JV begins at 5, followed by the varsity at 7. There will be a JV baseball game here on campus against Fairhope at 5. Tuesday, the boys golf team fell just short to Daphne and Bamonet, but today they get a chance at vindication at Soldiers Creek versus both of those teams. That's all from your locker room report with Leo Watson. Have an amazing day at Foley High School. Good morning, Foley High School. Grayson Mitchell. And my name is Madison Bright. And this is your Line 5 weather. For tomorrow, you will have a high of 64 and a low of 50. There will be winds at speeds of 5 to 10 miles per hour, and there will be a rainy weekend. Have a great day, Foley High School. Today for lunch, we'll be having cheesy chicken over rice, corn, green beans, fruit, and don't forget your grab and go. Have a great day. What nice little announcements we got for you today? Our shout outs go to Connor Waters and Megan Martinez. Don't forget that today's B Day. Have a great day full of high school.